just look at this studio filled with beautiful and imaginative gifts, which can be purchased today on Wheel of Fortune. Total retail value of all these prizes, more than $31,000. Now, let's meet the host of Wheel of Fortune, Chuck Woolery. Okay. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Thank you, Charlie. Oh, welcome to Wheel of Fortune. Now, to start things off on a bright note, Susie Stafford. Susie? Hey, Chuck. Susie? Well, you look pretty today. Thank you. Yeah. Do you know there are some days that I get up here and I felt, if I felt any better, I'd be arrested? Well, I have a fit. You're under arrest. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> you, you look awful pretty today. Thank you. Yeah. Let's talk to everybody. Yeah, how you doing? You do that? I'm going to do it right now. You? How you doing, Jerry? Fine. How are you? Doing? I'm fine. This is Jerry Stover. Jerry's originally from uh, Massachusetts. He's been here five weeks and he's single. He's been here five weeks. I haven't seen him around here five weeks. <laughs> you mean he's been here five weeks and I didn't know about it? Oh, in town, not here. I see. Oh, I got confused there. I thought you'd been right here five weeks and I overlooked you. No, I've been busy. <laughs> <laughs> nice to have you with us today, Thank Jerry. You. Good luck to you. Hi, Linda. Hi, Chuck. Linda Miller is our returning champion. She's got a three-day total of, check this out, $16,975. Way to go, Linda. Oh, I sure am. Yeah, okay. This is Lee Cerruti. Is that right, Lee? Saruti, yes. Right. You're a homemaker, I know, with two children. Okay. And you're uh, originally from Pennsylvania. Right. I'm going to be in Allentown in September. Really? Yeah, at the sure. fair, the Greater Allentown Fair. Sure. I'm going to be thinging and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Let's take a look at our Wheel of Fortune. Top dollar value on the wheel for the first round is $500. Look out for this black space bankrupt, because if you hit it, you lose all your cash, but not your merchandise, because once you buy a prize, it's yours to keep forever. Now let's take a look at our first puzzle. Okay, we're looking for a phrase. It's a phrase just for the show. We do numbers to see who start the game for us. And you won, Jerry, so you're going to start us off. Okay. Looking for a phrase. Here we go. $500 is what we need. We're 500 You're Come close. On, 500 You're close. Yeah! Oh. Boy, that's... Well, yeah, get it out of the way. Linda knows. Come on. Okay, Linda. Let's see where you end up. Thank you. 175 Give me a letter. Uh, can I have a T? Uh, yes. To your turn. Austin. Come All on. right. Come on, 500. 200, give me a little. Uh, an H. Yes, there's oh. an H. Okay. To your turn. Free spin territory. Come on, Come on. Come on. A little too much. 300. Uh, is there an F? An S? No. Lee, to you. Come on, Lee. Come on, Lee. We're looking for a phrase. Looking for three. He's looking for the right letter for $100. Okay, is there an R? An R, yes, there is. $100, Lee. Still your turn. Okay, Lee. Coming up on 500. A little too strong. 200. Is there a P? Yes, there's a P. 300. You can buy a vowel, guess the puzzle is done. Okay. Okay, Lee. And to 300. Uh, is there an N? An N? No. Sorry. Okay, Jerry. Come on, Jerry. 500. Come on. 500. 450. Hit it. Come on. Hit yeah. it. Ah, 150. Uh, Give me a uh, T. A T? It's T up there. Well, actually, a T's been called. You can't right. call it twice because if you do, you lose your turn. Linda, to you. Sorry. Sorry, Jerry. Okay, two fifty to one hundred dollars to four. Yeah, good money. Is there an L? Two of them. <laughs> Eleven seventy-five. We're looking for a phrase. I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. E. Yes. T. It's a phrase. You got nine twenty-five now. I'll spin. Okay. Good luck. Come on. Hurry! 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 $100. Is there a C? No. Lee to you. $300, Lee. Here we go. Come on. There goes five. To one. Uh, is there a D? No. Jerry? Looking for a phrase. You see, they have hard puzzles for the last couple of days starting off. A little more difficult for some reason. Is there an M? An M? Yes, sir. Yes, there is an M. <laughs> Can't trust that buzzer all the time. Still your turn. Hundred dollars. Okay, Jerry. Comes five hundred. No, 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 no. 
The 100? The 250. 250. All right, is there a K? Yes, sir. Sound means that there are only vowels left in the puzzle. You got $350, you can buy a vowel or solve it. I think I can solve it. Tell me. Kill the vampire. Wrong. Wrong. Mm. No. You know what that means? Linda, you get a shot at it. Tell me what it is. Kill the umpire. That's right! Oh. That's a tough way. It really is. Yeah, that's tough. That's tough. Hey, listen, you've made a lot of money off other people's mistakes. <laughs> No, no, but you have $925, oh. and you're going back to the powder room again. Did I go to the powder room yes, with you we once? Went there well, have a fit. Let's go back. What do you want to buy? Uh, $925. Let me see. I'd like the um, grooming accessories for $304. Okay. And the flowers and plants for $150. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice. Keep on going. You got about $400 something. Right? And uh, the hall tree for 299 Okay, that'll leave you about, I don't know, $172. Uh, the wicker bath accessories for yeah. 116 All right, the rest on the counter and a gift certificate. Ah, uh, gift certificate. You got please. it. Here's Charlie O'Donnell. Take the, oh, whoop, 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 wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You can get some towels for $39. I can I'll see them. You got them. Okay. The rest of that and a gift certificate. Fine. Here's Charlie O'Donnell. I'll tell you about your price. Okay. <laughs> Linda, let's start you off with this assortment of towels, including bath and hand towels and washcloths. Will brighten any bathroom. Retail value, $39. This trio of hot pink wicker accessories is sure to enliven any bathroom. Etagere is perfect for towels and knickknacks, spacious hamper and decorative mirror complete ensemble. Retail value $116. And each month for the next six months, your neighborhood Teleflorist will send to your home a new gift of flowers or plants by wire, furnished by Teleflora, retail value $150. Practical and decorative, this traditionally inspired coat tree has plenty of hooks to hold things, a beautiful oval mirror in the center, and a metal-lined umbrella trough. Use it as we have in the bath for towels and robes or in an entry hall. Furnished by Elliott's Fine Furniture of Burbank, California. Retail value $299. And Schick's assortment of personal appliances featuring the man's and lady's power stylers with attachments. Power to dry really fast for styles that really last. Grooming for the entire family furnished by Schick. Retail value $304. Right, that's terrific. Thank that's you. great. You know, by the way, I'd like to mention something. I've been getting some letters about people saying they don't like to see me hug folks. I want to tell you something. I like to hug folks. I'm a hugger. A lot of people are handshakers. I'm a hugger. I'm a hugger. And, and, okay. and one more thing. If you were here, I'd hug you too. We'll be back in a minute with round two and a thousand dollars. Good for you. <laughs> Welcome back to round two of Wheel of Fortune. Top dollar value on the wheel for this round is a thousand bucks. We've added another bankrupt, and I just can't wait to get away and hug somebody again, unless Jerry wins. I'm not going to hug you. <laughs> Let's take a look at our next puzzle. <laughs> We're looking for a title of something. Linda, it's your turn. Okay. Big title, too. A lot of money up here. Here we go. Right, come on. Thousand. Nine hundred. Oh, that's a tough one. Nine hundred. Oh, so close. Lee to you. No money involved. Three hundred. Give me a letter. Is there an N? There's bound to be a bunch of them up there. Two of them. Yes. Two of them. Six hundred dollars. Still your turn. Looking for that thousand dollars, you're in the territory, but I don't think you got enough stuff. Yeah, there's six though. Yeah, that's good. Uh, is there a T? Oh, one, two, three, four of them. Three thousand and uh, three thousand dollars even. Still your turn. Okay, I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. Uh, could I have an E, please? Oh, no E's. No E's, oddly enough. Okay, Jerry, here it goes. Looking for a title or something. It's a title. Good shape. Three foot. Give me an S. No, sir. No S. Linda, to you. Okay. Come on, Linda. Looking for a title or something, Linda. Come on. We're going to 600 bucks. Third G? Yes, two of those. <laughs> and while Linda's thinking this over, and everybody's thinking it over, we're going to take a commercial break, and we'll be right back to find out what the title is. Here. Well, something, Linda, you got $1,200. I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. Is there an I? Yes, ma'am, there are two of them. 
You gonna buy another vowel? Guess the puzzle is thing. I'm gonna buy another vowel. Okay. An O? No. Oh. Lost the 250 in your turn. Lee, it's coming to you. Okay, I'd like to spin. Okay, Lee. Come on, come on, no Here goes a thousand. No Lose a turn. No easy, Lee. Easy, easy, no! Do you know that you just lost $2,750? Oh, no. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lee. Oh. I'm sorry. Listen, it's not over yet. Jerry, to you. Okay. Not over you. Here we go. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, Can oh, you believe oh, oh. it? Linda's been saved again. Yes. Been Come saved on. again. Come on. Look at this, 300. Give me a letter. Can I have a B? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Can you turn on? Yes. Come on, Thousand. Come on, Here it comes. There it is. Is there a Y? Two of them. Still your turn. I'll spin. Yeah. I would, too, I believe. Look at this. And she's got it again. Do you? Yes. You did it again. May I have a C? Yes, ma'am. Two C. Want to do it again? Uh, no, I'm going to solve it. Chitty, chitty, bang, That's bang. That's right. <laughs> the folks at home, I don't think, know how much you have unless they can see it now. $5,300. What a round. Collector's Boutique. And there you go again. You want boats, cars, mink coat, uh, Paris trip, your microphone, which I've got around my arm. Yeah. <laughs> Anything you want. What would you like? For five thousand one hundred and forty-five dollars, I want that beautiful boat. <laughs> yeah, um, it's all yours. You got a hundred and fifty-five dollars left. For eighty-two dollars a bath. You've got it. The rest in a Giorgio gift certificate. If I know your style, and here's Charlie O'Donnell. Dave, that's your prizes, Charlie. Uh -huh. Hand woven in the People's Republic of China, this colorful collection of baskets is multi-purpose. Use one as a handbag or store sewing materials or letters in them. Or just enjoy them as decorative accessories. Retail value, $82. Linda, take a good look at this. This sleek 15-foot outboard runabout offering tri-hull construction for a soft, stable ride. Plenty of room for fishing, kappa, and scuba gear. A dependable 40-horsepower outboard engine and 15-foot trailer complete the package. Furnished by Rio Honda Marine, retail value $5,145. Boy, I gotta tell you, you know, it's really interesting. Lee said a minute ago, she said that, that uh, when she spun that last time and hit the bankrupt, that she knew it. And I, I just, my feeling about that is, is I think even if you got twenty-seven fifty, and it's that early, there were so many multiples in there and you knew it, that you just got to go for it and try to build. Because she did and, you know, boy. Beautiful. Uh-huh. We'll be back with round three. The interesting thing is that we got $1,500 on the wheel and anything can happen there. So stay with us. Yeah. Flakes, here's Chuck Willery. <laughs> Resemble that remark. All right. Here we go with round three of Wheel of Fortune. Jerry, Lee, you got no money yet. And Linda's on top with $6,225. Top dollar value now on the wheel is $1,500. And here's the next puzzle. Let's see if we can knock this one off. Looking for a person, Lee. Good luck. Here we go. There goes 15. There goes nine. 300. Give me a letter. Uh, could I have a T? No, there's no T. Uh, Jerry, you. Jerry. It's a person. Come on. 1500. Okay, buy 1500. Oh. Looking at five, I believe. You can hold it. Can I get an M? An M? Uh, yes, sir. You got an M. Oh. 500, say your turn. Come on. 1500. 15 by nine. Come, on. Come up on six. Hold it. Okay. Are there any S's? Any what? S's. S? No, sir. Okay, Linda? Come on, 15. Boy, if you ever picked the time to hit it, now it's time. I really oh, like it. It's over it. with. Oh. Yeah, Lee, to you. <laughs> no money involved. Come on. Not a tough start. 
Okay, 400. Give me a letter. Is there an R? An R? Yes, I'm. Two of them. Two of them. 800, steady your turn. You know your options. I'll spin. Okay. Come on, 1500. 515. Looking for a person. You're going to land on six. Give me a letter. Is there a P? A P? No. Okay, Jerry. A little tough. A little tougher this time. Come on, you 50. Three. Got an H. A what? An H? No, sir. No H. Linda. Boy, having a tough time. Tough. Come on. All right. 500? 500, yeah. Right. Is there an L? Two of them. <laughs> Looking for a person. You got $1,000 Linda, so you're coming. I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. E. Yeah. There's an E. I'll spin. Okay. Come on. Come on. All right. 200. Um, is there a D? A D? No, no D. We'll be right back. Hold on just a minute. Don't touch the wheel. We'll come back in just a minute. <laughs> Back, we're looking for a person. Lee, it's your turn. I'm gonna guess it. I'm chicken. <laughs> You're gonna guess it, really? Yeah. Okay. If you want to, okay. go ahead. You can do number. Well, whatever you want to do. I don't want to. Norman push. Rockwell. Norman Rockwell is it for eight hundred dollars? That's right. Oh. You got it. Sure. Go hard. You doing? <laughs> doing good. Okay. This is the last round. Discover America Showcase and whatever you want to do. Okay, for five hundred and thirty-nine dollars, I'd like the sound movie camera. Okay. Two hundred and sixty-one bucks. Okay, uh, for one hundred and eighty-six dollars, I'd like the canoeing package. All right, where is that? One hundred eighty-six. Okay, got seventy-five, and that goes in the gift certificate. Here's Charlie O'Donnell. I'll tell you about that. Oh. Those prizes. That's what it is. <laughs> Race the rapids of Colorado, Utah, and Pennsylvania in this whitewater canoe. It's a two-man inflatable canoe made of tough new material that's safe, stable, needs no upkeep, and is unaffected by salt water, sun, or chlorine. Oars, life vest, and pump complete the package, furnished by United Sporting Goods, retail value $186. And Lee, it's the Sankyo Super 8 sound movie camera with zoom lens, unique telescopic microphone, and looks carrying case. Easy operation and high fidelity sound furnished by Sankyo. Retail value $539. Let's take a look at the final scores and announce the winner. Jerry, you've been out here five weeks. Is this the fifth or the sixth week? It's the fifth week. You won't forget the fifth week, Jerry. <laughs> no, well, it's, it's been fun, though. It's a pleasure a to have you on the show, really. Are you working yet? Yes, I am. What are you doing? Can I'm you in Death Square. Are you? In a hotel. Right. That's great. Nice to have you with us, and I'm sorry you didn't win anything. We got some nice parting gifts for you, Enjoyed so you don't myself. go away empty-handed. I hope you did, really, because we like to have fun and, you know, have people have fun with us. Okay. <laughs> All right, thank you. Thank you, Jared. Lee, well, honey, after you lost the 2700 Just a chicken. <laughs> I know, but you got your 800 and uh, I was great. glad to see that you really was going to, you were really all out to go for as much as you could get on that last one. <laughs> on, on the last one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there was no, there was half the puzzle left up there. Why did you go for the 800? Well, that just proved I was unlucky, so I figured I better take afraid? what I had. Do me a favor. Camera, before we announce the winner, I want, I want Lee to do me a favor. Lee, if you can get it on the overhead camera, spin the wheel one more time. I want to see where you would have landed. Oh. Okay. Just one more time. You would have had fifteen hundred more dollars. I'm happy. I'm really I'm happy. I'm glad you are. <laughs> it's nice to have you. Yeah, have a good time with your eight hundred dollars in merchandise. Linda, well, darling, you did it again. You're the champ. You got six thousand two hundred and twenty-five dollars. Is that a, you're just you are amazing. You really are. You got a four-day total. Listen to this four-day total: twenty-three thousand two hundred dollars. Oh. I got a couple of questions to ask. One is, I'd like to know. I think that uh, I think that Linda now had the high total for any single day in the half-hour show over eight thousand dollars. Is that true? She holds a record for that now, the high total. I'm sure that everybody out there is keeping score and is going to go yeah, to the Guinness right. World Book of Records. But she got the highest one round. How much was the one round? 
$83.25 for one round. Okay. I didn't know that. If that's misinformation, then we'll just tell you all these lies. Doesn't matter. <laughs> one other thing. Who's got the highest so far for a half-hour show? She's second. She's second right now. Got, well, she's got one more day left, though. Anything could happen. Mm. i tell you what we're going to do. We're going to take a commercial and be right back at you. Stay with us. It's been good today. Wow. <laughs> Coming up. It's us saying goodbye to you. Bye See you bye. next time. Thank bye bye. You. <laughs> Brand new Grand Slam. The quarterfinals kick off with Brainiac's Brad Rutter and Ogie Ogus going head to head. Then it's heavy hitter David Legler versus game show vet Lesek Palovich in the smartest show on earth. Only the strong survive. Grand Slam, hosted by Dennis Miller and Amanda Byram. Tonight, 7 6 Central on GSN.